Now, the one Michael Grover has, he's got a special one for poetry. That's uh, yours. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. Hi. What is your name? You were the artist? Yeah. Yes. What's your name? Danny. Hi, Danny Chuck. Hi. I like it. Thank you. Thank you. How long have you been doing this stuff? All your life? Oh, no. <laughs> um, probably like four years. What did you do? Did you start uh, picking out uh, with scraps of paper? Did you start like that? How did you start? Jeans. I, yeah, jeans. I got the zippers of the jeans. Yeah, which one? Do you have one of the jean zippers here? I have that one, the bird down there. There's oh, this one? Jeans right there. That one's all zippers. Oh, this one. This one is. This one right here is all zippers. Oh. Oh, good job. Yeah. So, what else do you have to show me here? Um, this one is done in denim in sequence. Oh, nice. So what else besides denim and zippers? Hair. Hair? Yep, human hair. Mm, okay. And zippers on that one. Human hair and zippers. Yep. And along with this one has hair and it also on dryer lint. And dryer lint, right. I've heard about all of these things. Someone's doing it somewhere. <laughs> it's dryer lint. Yes. Wow, good. <laughs> Danny, thanks a lot. Thank you. This will be on YouTube in a couple weeks. Oh, yay. Thank Is you. Thank you very much. Danny Herrera. Herrera? Herrera. Herrera. Yes. Oh, Herrera. Oh, Herrera. <laughs> okay, Danny, thanks. Thank you. So what's your name? Mine's Chuck. My name's Eric. Eric? Yeah. Hey, glad to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Here, just work on it and I'll make, I'm making a video here. Uh, as much as I can. I'm only, I only have a little time today, but... But since you're in the middle of this, so is this called anything in particular? This looks like it's a Van Gogh of some sort with the irises. Well, uh, it's a drone strike, I guess. Oh. I haven't titled it or anything. Oh, okay. Is it a drone strike in America or in another country? Do you don't know? Well, I don't really know what Afghanistan looks like. Oh, so right. It's just so, a general drone strike. Okay, good. <laughs> uh, I did look at a postcard of Afghanistan, so I was trying to do the shacks and stuff, but a little out of control right now. I'm gonna have to oh, so I like it, yeah. Beautiful, beautiful. Oh, you got two of them there, huh? Here, this will be on, uh, on YouTube in about two weeks. Let's look under Artomatic. What's your name again? Eric. Eric. Yeah, what's your last name? Steiger. Steiger Chuck Schmidt. Eric. Nice to meet you.
So this is where you check in, huh? Yeah. Oh, good. Got a lot of volunteers? Yeah. Everyone who's part of the show has to volunteer for at least 10 hours. To do so other... All 500 artists have to do 10 hours of service. Oh, there are 500 artists? There are. Oh, good. Who's, who's best at giving me a, a 30 second or one minute rundown of what's happening here? Anybody? You'll want to talk to Michelle Carlson or Ryan Dunn. Do you know? Or Ryan Bunch. Do you know who either of them are? I, no, I don't, but if you don't know, nobody would know. I can get them information over here. I can, or I can get them over here to give you information. You know, well, we're making a video right now. So, I don't really need them if, you're, if that's okay. I'll just keep on going. I just thought for a chance here I could get a little extra. Uh, well, this is the, I can tell you, there, this is the largest unjured art show in the region. And there are 500 artists, 400 visual artists, about 100 non visual or performing artists who are participating in the show this year. Mm -hmm. uh, people come out and reserve their space. They pay $25 for their space, they do 10 hours of service, and then they show for all three weeks. What kind of service do they do? It could be anything from helping with the housekeeping to building the walls to uh, being security or... So, right, so it must have to be mostly local people to be able to, to do that, you think? Yeah, or if you're here and you're showing anyways, mm -hmm. we just pull you away from your booth for a couple of hours at a time. Okay. Go from there. So, then, then, then do people sell their work here? People can sell their work can't as long as work? they have a vendor's license. Oh, okay. And the Arts Commission offers workshops if people are interested in getting a vendor's license or need more information about how to do that. Mm -hmm. And then all of the commission off of their pieces is theirs to keep. Oh, okay, good. Is there anything else you'd like No, to that's all. Okay. Thanks a lot. Thank you. I'll give you a card. Okay, thanks everybody. All right. This will be up in about a week and a half probably. Thank you. I have five grown children. Hi. Who's the artist? What's your name? Jacqueline Bailey. Hi Jacqueline, what do you make? Oh, you got food for me. Good. I mean, you can eat her food, but you can eat it. No, I don't. So, what do you make, Jacqueline? I do paintings. I do prints, I do art gift cards, mm -hmm. I grow birdhouse boards, oh, and good. I, I hand paint those. Oh, good. I don't like her. Um, we do hands-on activities with the kids. What's this? What's your name? Lily. What is it? Lily. Lily. Hi, Lily. Look at your arm. And yeah, that's oh, my, my security. <laughs> so she, she's allowed to leave with where I'm at. Oh, well, that, what's really nice, though, that's like kid tattoos, I think. Okay, thank you. Of course, thank you. And I was like, well, she, you, Oh, okay. Oh, this wall is good. Yeah.